Welcome to Scoop Canada, your most trusted source for the latest news on Canadian politics. The Green Slush Fund has recently been at the center of an ongoing controversy due to its vast financial scope and purported aim of funding environmental projects. This billion-dollar fund was designed to channel resources into innovative green initiatives, potentially transforming Canada's approach to sustainability. However, the perception of the fund took a nosedive with emerging allegations against its chair. Concerns have surfaced regarding potential conflicts of interest that could undermine the integrity of the allocation process. Critics have pointed fingers at the chair for possible financial entanglements and connections that might bias the fund's decisions, casting a shadow over its operations. The situation escalated when the Ethics Commissioner formally accused the chair of violating the Conflict of Interest Act. According to the Commissioner, the chair failed to disclose pertinent financial interests and engage in practices that compromised impartiality. This accusation signifies a severe breach and raises critical questions about enforcing ethical standards in government appointments. These revelations have stoked public outrage, challenging the credibility of the Green Slush Fund and its governance. The growing scandal has intensified scrutiny on those involved and set the stage for what promises to be a contentious debate about accountability and ethics in public service. The Ethics Commissioner accused the chair of the Green Slush Fund of multiple violations of the Conflict of Interest Act. The chair allegedly failed to disclose significant financial interests in companies directly benefiting from the fund's investments, a severe breach of the regulations designed to ensure impartiality and transparency. Moreover, the chair was also implicated in making decisions favoring those companies compromising the fund's integrity. These actions violated the Conflict of Interest Act and undermined public trust in the management of the billion-dollar green slush fund. While the Trudeau government faces severe criticism over Green Slush Fund, Scoop Canada remains committed to bringing unfiltered and timely news on Canadian political hot topics. Stay tuned as we delve into the controversies generated by Liberal Party members. Violations of the Conflict of Interest Act carry significant legal and political consequences. The act is designed to maintain public confidence in government decision-making processes. Its breach implies potential legal ramifications for those involved and jeopardizes the credibility of government-funded programs. Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has faced scrutiny for his involvement in appointing the chair of the Green Slush Fund. Given the fund's high profile and substantial financial backing, its leadership selection was crucial. Trudeau's decision-making process and possible oversight failures in thoroughly vetting the chair have become focal points in the political discourse. The Ethics Commissioner's accusation has sparked widespread public outrage. Many Canadians feel betrayed by a fund that was supposed to support environmental sustainability but now seems mired in accusation and controversy. Uppermost in the public's mind is the possibility that financial interests influence decisions that could have otherwise been impartial and transparent. This has led to calls for stringent oversight and accountability measures to ensure such breaches do not happen again. The Conservative Party has been vocal about the alleged violations. They argue that the accusations against the Green Slush Fund's chair highlight systemic problems within the Trudeau government. Conservative leaders, including Andrew Scheer, have used social media to express their disapproval, urging immediate action and accountability. The party has called for a complete fund audit and stringent disciplinary actions against those involved in the alleged breaches. Also, discover our exclusive collection of mugs, hoodies, and various daily accessories designed for Canadian Conservative Party supporters. Show your pride with our conservative-themed products at an affordable price. Enjoy free delivery across Canada. Our media outlets nationwide have closely covered the unfolding controversy. Headlines have ranged from factual reports on the Ethics Commissioner's findings to op-eds questioning the integrity of government-appointed positions. This extensive coverage has significantly shaped public perception, casting a shadow over the fund's original environmental goals, Public faith in government programs has been shaken, leading to demands for greater transparency in the appointment process and management of such funds. The government has staunchly defended the integrity of the Green Slush Fund and its chair's actions. Officials have pointed out that the fund has successfully financed numerous eco-friendly projects positively impacting communities across Canada. And regarding the chair, Trudeau and his cabinet have underscored her extensive experience and contributions to environmental stewardship arguing that any alleged breaches were accidental and not intended to benefit specific entities unjustly. The controversy surrounding the Green Slush Fund has significantly affected the credibility of Trudeau's government. 
This incident has cast a shadow over Trudeau's leadership, raising questions about his judgment in appointing the fund's chair and his administration's overall commitment to ethical governance. Many critics argue that the government's failure to vet the chair appropriately signals a broader issue of oversight. Consequently, the controversy has provided ammunition to political opponents who suggest that ethical lapses and a lack of transparency mar Trudeau's administration. The Green Slush Fund was designed to spearhead Canada's efforts in combating climate change, focusing on funding innovative environmental projects. However, the scandal has jeopardized the fund's mission. Public distrust and political infighting may reduce funding and support for environmental initiatives. Additionally, legislative action might impose stricter regulations and oversight on similar funds, potentially stifling operational flexibility. The consequence is a possible slowdown in Canada's progress towards meeting its environmental goals, Public trust in government spending is crucial for the smooth functioning of democratic institutions. The allegations against the chair and the subsequent accusations by the ethics commissioner have eroded confidence in how public funds are allocated and managed. Citizens are increasingly wary of mismanagement and potential corruption, leading to calls for more robust auditing and accountability mechanisms. This erosion of trust may hinder future governmental spending initiatives as public scrutiny and skepticism grow. The implications of this controversy stretch beyond the immediate fallout, affecting long-term public perceptions and political dynamics in Canada. The Green Slush Fund controversy has significantly challenged the reputation of the Trudeau government. The billion-dollar fund intended to support environmental initiatives came under fire when the Ethics Commissioner accused the chair of violating the Conflict of Interest Act. Specific allegations included failing to disclose financial interests and exhibiting partiality, which compromised the fund's integrity, Public outrage intensified as scrutiny revealed gaps in vetting processes and questioned Prime Minister Trudeau's oversight in appointing the chair. Addressing the controversy requires a multifaceted approach. Firstly, implementing stricter oversight mechanisms for fund operations and mandatory transparency will be crucial. An independent audit of the Green Slush Fund can identify deficiencies and recommend corrective actions. Enhancing the Conflict of Interest Act to include more rigorous compliance checks could prevent future violations. Strengthening the leadership vetting process will also ensure that appointees adhere to the highest ethical standards. The long-term implications of this controversy could be extensive. Politically, it may weaken public trust in Trudeau's administration and its capacity for ethical governance. This erosion could reduce the effectiveness of future government spending initiatives and diminish public support for necessary environmental policies. Consequently, Canada's progress towards its ecological goals may need to be improved as the controversy casts doubts on the efficacy and integrity of green funding programs. Do take a minute to visit our website. Sign the petition demanding Justin Trudeau leave the office immediately and sign up for our newsletter to get uncensored news on Canadian politics. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more updates. The rebuilding public trust will be a lengthy process but it is essential for the future of Canadian politics and environmental initiatives.